Go ahead and make him back up again. We're just going to keep working on that, stopping back a little bit. Hopefully here. I won't stop him again until he's back relaxed and has some sort of cadence going around this corner, going around this turn. See when he gets that cadence and nose so that neck softens up. Oh, he lowers that head and that neck. There we go. There we go. Always got one side that'll work a little bit easier than the other. some more. See I got that <coughs> rope wrapped around his leg and it doesn't bother him a bit. That's all about the round pin work we did earlier. So he feels that rope down there. He's not freaking out over it. He's not worried about it. Oh. Oh, yeah. That was a bummer, wasn't it, bud? step to him here a little bit more and keep him from turning in so much. A 
way away from that pressure is back. See, going around to the right, he drops his head a lot more. He gets a lot better cadence trotting around there. He's just more relaxed going to that right than he is to that left. So I have to work on that left quite a bit more. I'm gonna go ahead and bid him up here a little bit more. Let that let that bit dance around on his face here a little bit, and get him used to that bit moving around in there a little bit more. I'm going to cross these underneath the front legs over the saddle. Never do this very, very incrementally. We don't want to get tight on them. We don't want them to feel trapped and, and feel like they have to explode to get out of it. We don't want to get them into a bind. We want to slowly teach them to get off the pressure. This is pretty loose here. But as them front legs go, and that chest goes, it's going to bounce on this bit a little bit and soften that face up and keep that jaw nice and soft and loose. <clears throat> here, when I do this, my main concern here is keep this horse moving forward. Do not let him get going back. They get going back. Get going back, they push against that bit and they start running backwards. Get you into one heck of a bind. I just want him to drive in there. Feel them, them reins bounce around, that bit bounce around in his mouth. Get him to accept it. earlier that he's not as comfortable going around this way having a lot tougher time accepting everything I'm gonna let him do this quite a bit more just go around this way See, he's always pushing to that outside of that circle. Always wanting to kind of stop and not, not give me good consistent cadence all the way around. So I'm just gonna keep him moving here until I feel he's, he's getting better. Looking for better, not perfection. better circle there. So last time I went this way when I said whoa he didn't listen to me too well. I'm gonna be a little more ready for him this time. When I tell him to if he doesn't, I will change directions on him pretty, pretty quickly and make him think that word damn sure means something. He better listen to it and not just walk through it.
Whoa. See how he just kind of walked through it and kind of wanted to walk up to me there. Oh. See if we can sharpen that up a little bit. Whoa, a lot better, a lot better. So for me, that's good for this first time working them, bitting them up a little bit, getting them in this in this square pin, kind of teaching them to trot around here, trotting these small circles like this. Definitely, they got to reach up underneath themselves to trot these small circles. They have to frame up or they'll fall down in here. They'll be falling all over the place. For them to get that consistency in that circle and that cadence around here, they got to have some natural collection coming around here and they figure that out on their own. I really don't want, if I got a choice now at this point, when I, when I stop my horse, I don't want them coming to me. Because if I say whoa and they come to me, whoa doesn't mean stop. Whoa means come to me, right? That's not what I, whoa means stop and back up. So when I say whoa, I want them to stop and just stand there. I'll go to them. You know, I can always bring them off by my body here and they'll follow me here by what I did in the round pen. But when I ask them to stop, 